we start with one hour chart just i want to give a quick update first of all if you refer to my last analysis since the price was within here we discussed about how we can look for the trade anyway we didn't get any opportunity to look for buy and whatever the trade was it was a short term and now we start with the higher time frame we start with the daily chart all right again if you refer to our analysis we have mentioned we are within this correction how complex can be this correction later we will be discussed but at this point how deep this correction can go with the breakout of the 30.5 we can expect the price drop to 26.4 following by 22 all right this is because we want to see how deep this correction can be but we pre prefer to see the reversal at least without the breakout of 26.4 at least we see the breakout and the reversal as a video the breakout of this zone all right because if the price drops some more more than that even we can expect the price drop to even we can expect the price break 22 all right that's why we prefer to see the reversal without breakout of this zone at least 26.4 all right and based on daily chart we have nothing else to discuss the only thing is we want to see whether we can get the reversal and if we move to forward chart at this point we can consider this one as an internal flat in relative to this as a one two three all right how deep this one can go with a breakout of 30.5 we can expect even the price break the previous low, which is somewhere around 28.8, all right? That's why we mentioned with the breakout of the 30.5, we can expect the price even drop to 26.4. But if we get any reversal, any trade setup for buy within this range, we will take it, all right? Internally, even we can expect to see the correction similar to what we have here for one more drop because based on indicators, we don't see really good divergence. Based on forward, I mean, the MACD, we can put this to as a divergence, but another indicator doesn't show me, all right? That's why we can expect to see the internal flat as well. But if we get any trade setup for buy, we will take it and we want to see the price tag 44.5 with the breakout of the 42. The first things we need to look for is 38. All right. Anyway, if we get any trade setup for buy, I will give an update. But as we can see, at this point, we don't see any trade setup and we don't see any reversal based on forward chart. And if we move to one hour chart, from now, we will expect to see the divergence. All right. And even from here. That's why if we get any trade setup for buy, we will take it. Having entry above this can be an option, but we should know that if the price tag, we want to see the price tag break and continue. If the price tag, we see is not, if the price tag we see is not moving within the first or maximum second hours, we take out the trade. Either we look for the reversal as a sharp move flag or we put our entry above here. Okay. As I mentioned, still we can expect the price drop some more as what I explained based on higher time frame. That's mean if you get any opportunity, any small correction similar to any of this, we can look for sell. But sell is a short term sell. As long as we get into the profit, we have to move our sub loss to break even. All right, but for the long term, we are looking for the reversal. Anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.